you guys? Welcome back into the kitchen with me and my little bro. Today we are doing weird food combos in the kitchen. I have a couple made up and I have one on the way, but the ones that we're going to start with, I, we're actually going to start with this one. The first weird food combo we're going to try is going to be uh, bread, butter, and sprinkles. I don't know where this came up with, but we're going for it. It's literally bread, butter, and sprinkles. That's all it is. One. Actually, it's not that bad. Really, Hayden? Just swallow it. It's not that bad. Wimp. Oh, never again. It's actually not that bad. That is disgusting. I don't mind it. So honestly, I would rate this sandwich out of five. I would give it at least a three and a half. It's not that bad. Like, if you're really, if you're hungry and you're kind of poor and you don't have much to go off of, this will literally fill you up. This next one I'm really excited for. I'm gonna give credit where credit's due. Our dad actually sent me this vlog idea. This is a peanut butter grilled cheese sandwich. Yes, you have the peanut butter, cheese, and the bread. Uh, I'm excited to try it. I was like, oh my god, that sounds really, really interesting. I am so excited to try this. Put a lot of peanut butter on there. <laughs> it's different, but it's not bad. The flavors don't mix. First, you'll take a bite, you'll taste the peanut butter, and you'll taste the bread. The more you keep chewing, then you'll taste the cheese. See, yeah, it's not bad. I was like, it's not the one thing I would like recommend to people, but it's okay. Yeah. Like, honestly, I would give that a three. Three. Two and a half, three. I, I would do three. It's an okay. It's okay. All right, the last thing we're gonna do is Doritos and mac and cheese. You have the Dorito, really, really good. Mac and cheese, really, really good. The Dorito is like an edible spoon, basically. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know, three and a half. Four. Hayden, I, the only reason I knew Hayden was gonna like this one was because he's like obsessed with junk food. That was the three that I made today. I'm actually kind of thinking of doing a fourth right now. You know what, let's do a fourth, we're doing it. This last one is apple, or um, goldfish and apple juice. This one's gonna be interesting, because it's something that is either gonna taste really good or really bad. All right, well, I'm going the other way then. Oh, dear Lord, that's gonna be gross. All right, let's try it. I, I don't know, I can't believe it. Cheers. Actually, that's not all that bad. You have the apple juice, and then you have the goldfish, and you know, it's, it's a great snack for little kids when you do like goldfish and apple juice, but mixing them like this, it's actually not that bad. Is Throwing it, it in like this, iffy. I don't know. But I didn't mind it. It wasn't, it wasn't bad. It wasn't bad. Honestly, any of these things that we tried today, in my mind, not bad. Were, were really not horrible. They, they all tasted fine, they all, they were all weird food combos, don't get me wrong, but guess what? That's that just the name of the game, that's what we decided to do for a vlog today. Here, I'll, I'll list off the other ones that we never tried today. Cold pizza dipped in soda. Oh, we should've done that one. Pickle, pickles and orange juice. Popcorn and hot sauce. And then ketchup and pizza. Those are the four that we didn't try today, and then the other four ideas I had, we did. That's it for today's vlog. Make sure you like it, subscribe, tweet me at Walker Schmidt 11. Guys, my next vlog will be uploaded on November 11th, which is Veterans Day. So I hope you guys have a very happy holidays and a great weekend. Until next time, I'll see you later. Boom!